it's time for turkeys. Turkeys are a great thing. Yes, they are. And it's Thanksgiving, so everybody better give thanks. Because Thanksgiving is wonderful. Alright? Um, I didn't really have anything planned for a Thanksgiving video. So basically, I'm just going to read a short pilgrim passage. In a funny way. The 17th century pilgrims are known through the writings and artifacts that they left behind. Why don't they leave artifacts behind? What is... Is anyone going to buy the artifacts at a store or something? There is much more to this story. Oh, good, more. However, than the 17th century facts, there's also the pilgrim story. Really? It's called the Pilgrim Story? We never would have guessed. <laughs> oh, that's oh, that story is the celebration of a few selected moments which have fixed the Pilgrim's family in America's collective memory. Well, it was so collective, why do we have to buy, buy it? Why do we have to buy turkeys at the store? Maybe we can just collected over all these years. I'm sure we have turkeys stored up somewhere. Huh? Or they're, or they're just sitting there dusting all all away and stuff. Anyways, back to the reading. This pilgrim story has grown and evolved over time. As each succeeding generation looks to the past for inspiration and guidance, certain key elements of the 17th century pilgrims were emphasized. The attention focused on these key elements as sometimes obscured other parts of the pilgrim story. Oh, I'm sure there's a lot of obscured parts in this part. I mean, story. Changing the perception of the pilgrim experience, often these later interpretations of the 17th century pilgrim tell us about the pilgrims than about the emotional and political needs of the era in which the interpretations were created. Well, if you're not going to focus on political stuff, then I'm just going to leave this story. I mean, let's keep on. As you scroll through the subject headings listed below, you will encounter key elements of the Pilgrim story that have been celebrated in stories and in paintings. The Mayflower Compact, the landing, first Thanksgiving at Plymouth, each of these elements of the Pilgrim story are based on 17th century facts. Well, finally, they got something right. Um, each element has also received layers of interpretations and celebrations. These later interpretations are also history. America's history of the 18th, 19th, 20th, and now 21st centuries. We invite you to search through the layers of retelling to find the foundation of the 17th century. Where does it all begin, and how does it end? You might be... I don't, I'm not going to be surprised by this crap. They want us to go to, to a door and tell us pilgrim story. About facts, and how you kept turkeys laying in the basement all these years, that, you, that we happened to just have people remake, and then we had to waste our money on this? What is Thanksgiving come to these days? It's all just me. No, it's not. Happy Thanksgiving, y'all. See you next Friday for a new video. It's a video reviewing show that you might see on YouTube a lot. I'd have the number three in it. Yeah. Did a parody of that. It'll be up next Friday. It's a new skit example vid. Two examples as always. Have a Thanksgiving. Go and eat turkey or what not and crap with your family and have a good one. That's next. Uh, bye. But I say, you know, whatever, hey.
Yeah. I provide animal support. <laughs>